Now, your exclusive seven storm team forecast. I like this picture a lot. Sleep tight weather view takes us a little bit up the river north of Quincy to uh, obviously the Mississippi sunset over the Mississippi. And Mike, I'll say it again, just wait for those trees to start turning colors because then you're going to have the entire river lined with, you know, orange and, and yellow. It's going to be great, but this is still a pretty nice shot. Too. That's a really nice night out there. Yeah. Look at that. The weather today has been fantastic with all the sunshine, dry yeah. weather, light winds. We had a light breeze out of the northwest, but uh, it really didn't hamper things too much. Temperatures still made their way on up into the lower 70s for some locations. Yeah. 60s for the rest of us. We got to 69 here in Quincy today, and uh, we'll see if we can do it again for you tomorrow. But I will tell you ahead of time, uh, we're going to look at a little cooler weather the rest of this week, and I'll tell you more about that in just a second or so. But right now, look at that beautiful imagery coming in here. The satellite and radar coming up with a big blank across the tri-states, much of Missouri, Iowa, and the southern two-thirds of Illinois. No clouds, just gorgeous weather conditions out there. Clear skies will continue on through this evening, and we're going to go with temperatures falling into the 40s for lows overnight tonight. So cool, seasonably cool, but nothing too chilly out there. And uh, we're going to go with the high temperature through the 50s into the lower 60s tomorrow. So got to 69 today. We'll be up around 62 later on tomorrow afternoon with mostly clear skies. So it'll still be nice, just not as warm as it was today. Quiet fall weather on tap. Lots of dry times too. You're going to love the next several days. Not too much in the way of rain chances, dry weather conditions, and for the most part, seasonable weather conditions. Highs in the 60s, lows in the 40s. Right now we have 66 out in Kirksville, 64 in Keokuk, 63 down in Hannibal, further out east, 61 one in Macomb and a pair of 66 in Pittsfield and in Jacksonville. So for the better part of the region, it's been a quiet day of weather. The winds generally out of the northwest at about 5 to 10 miles an hour right now here in the tri-states. And altogether, it is still quiet out at the airport. 64 degrees, clear skies, winds out of the north-northwest near 10 miles an hour. And uh, you know what? What can you say? Temperatures today coming in above average. Uh, temperatures near 70 degrees for much of the tri-states. It's cooled back to 56 in Chicago, 68 down in St. Louis, 69 degrees over in Kansas City, where they're going to be playing fall baseball in the end of October over in Kansas City tomorrow night for the World Series. So what we also have up that way is a large dome of high pressure that's centered over parts of Nebraska, Iowa, and northwestern Missouri. That's going to slide off to our north here. Keeping us really quiet tonight. High pressure systems are noted for their fair weather skies and their dry weather conditions, their light winds and uh, comfortable temperatures generally this time of year. And that's what we're going to have. Lows tonight back in the lower to middle 40s for the tri-states. Tomorrow we'll take it up somewhere into the lower 60s, probably 7 to 10 degrees cooler than what we saw for highs today in Quincy tonight. 44 for a low. Lots of stars out there. A pretty moon. Mostly clear skies, winds out of the north, northwest 5 to 15. Tomorrow, mostly sunny skies, 62 degrees for a daytime high, right around seasonal norms there. As we head on into the next seven days, though, you're going to see 61 on Wednesday. A slim chance of rain later on Thursday, though. 20% coverage of some showers there. Friday, 65, and, well, not bad. Partly sunny to mostly sunny. Saturday looks sharp. Sunny skies, high temperatures right there in the upper 60s to right around 70 degrees. Great golf weather on Saturday, Sunday 68, and mostly sunny. So, you know, over the next six, seven days, you can't really complain about that. We're going to see seasonable temperatures. And, you know, there's a lot of work going on out in the fields out there. More mm -hmm. dry weather for all the farmers as they do their work, and uh, we're in pretty good shape. All right. Thanks, Mike. Turn things over to